Welcome back everybody to Standard Surveying Solutions. Today we are going to go over a requested problem by one of our viewers. So let's just go ahead and jump right into it and start solving. So what's the problem, Bob? A survey party has set offset stakes for construction of an 8-inch sewer shown in the design plan below. The existing 12-inch sewer is uncovered at MH1 and found to have an actual flow line of 1228.69 rather than design of 1228.47. The gradient must be revised, holding the ele FL elevation of 1229.27 at manhole 2. If the elevation of the grade stake is 1235.06 at station 1 plus 25, what is the cut to the flow line that you would mark on the stake? So what do we need to solve for? We need to find the cut to the flow line at station 1 plus 25 for the grade stake. We know the flow line at manhole 1 of 1228.69, we know the flow line at manhole 2 at 1229.27, and we know the elevation of the stake at 1235.06. We need to determine the difference in the elevation at the stake. There are no equations in the FS Reference Handbook that will help you solve this. We have to rely solely on grade school geometry for this one. We have a delta is equal to the rise over run, which is equal to y over x. So we have a flow line at manhole 1 of 1228.69 at station 0 plus 0, 0. And then the flow line of manhole 2 is equal to 1229.27 at station 2 plus 47.55. Then the elevation of our stake is 1235.06 and that is at station 1 plus 25. So then, using slopes, we have a delta is equal to rise over run, which is your y over your x difference, which comes out to 1229.27 minus 1228.69 all divided by 2 plus 47.55 which is just the feet of the difference in our stationing from 0 to 247.55 so again delta is rise over run using calculator we have 0 0.58 divided by 247.55, again, feet from manhole 2 to manhole 1. This comes out to 0 0.00234, and we have to multiply this by the stationing of our stake in order to get the difference in elevation between the stake and a point, either manhole 1 or manhole 2. So if the elevation is equal to 0 0.00234 multiplied by 125. And this comes out to 0 0.293. So we'll take this and we will add it to our beginning elevation of manhole 1. So uh, our new E, so therefore our new E is equal to 0 0.293 plus 1228.69. This comes out to 1228.98. And then we will find the difference between that elevation and the elevation of our stake in order to find what should be on the lath. So 1228.98 minus 1235.06 and 
And so we have a final elevation of 6.077, which rounds to 6.08, which one is one of our answer choices and our final answer. So we have answer choice B, 6.08 feet. This problem really takes me back to middle school, solving slopes and distances, and that's just how we have to remember this problem. So thanks for tuning in to Standard Surveying Solutions, everybody, and uh, be sure to like, follow, and subscribe for next time.